Good morning. Today is Wednesday. Wednesday the 10th of March. Yeah. What day is it today? Someone's birthday. It's someone's birthday. It's David's birthday today. Excuse the appearance. I woke up early. I've done a workout. I'm just trying to mm. prepare, 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 prepare yeah. breakfast. Harry wants to show you something though. What did you get yesterday? You got a baby Yoda, the child Burger. Grogu. You got that from the Disney store yesterday, so he's yeah. very excited. Um, so just getting breakfast all ready. Miserable, miserable day outside today. It's not looking great at all. But just getting some jungle juice ready. So jungle juice is obviously, if those of you have been, it is the Animal Kingdom juice, but if you go to any of the Walt Disney World resorts, for breakfast, they have the same juice, it's just different names. So it's basically orange, guava, and passion fruit in equal parts. That is what we're doing now. Mm -hmm. And Dad'll like his breakfast. Yeah. Yeah. Is the birthday boy awake yet? Yeah. Yep. Well, we better get cracking, because you have got school. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Bo. Boo. Boo. So this has got what we've got ready for the birthday boy. Emily's made a lovely happy birthday banner with lots of awesome stuff on it. Love that picture. Sorry David. Oh bless him. Look how young we look. Touch that. Tell you, I've got a balloon arch bubble, Toy Story, and here's a birthday boy. Look, I've already got someone sat in his seat. And then we've got this. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear David. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Good morning. <laughs> Don't look at my legs. Oh. Well. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in the car. Guess what we're doing? I'm taking the birthday boy to the tip. Are you excited? Extremely. So we're going to the tip. Then we're going to B and Q. Again, the same reason we went to the garden centre the other day uh, to see if we can find any, what we can find, like bricks and stones and stuff. It's not so exciting, but it's for the garden. Um, the B&Q is right by the shopping centre, so we might take you for a five guys for your lunch. Sounds like a good idea. Um, and then before we know it, it'll be time to take the kids up. The weather is awful. It just doesn't do it justice through the camera. But it's just horrific. David got so wet doing the school run this morning. Not quite the birthday we envisaged. Obviously with it being locked down we would have had to run somewhere and then we were gonna go for a walk, but we can't do that either. Go no tip instead. Save it all for Hawaii. Hawaii? I'm not going to Hawaii. The big plan that I want to do for our combined 40th is a few days in New York and then a few days in Orlando for the run Disney Marathon. We don't even know if that's going ahead yet so this is a pipe dream of mine. Rather than the marathon though I want to do the Dopey Challenge. Are you going to do it with me? No. no. And we're thinking about this as a trip with, by ourselves without the kids. We don't know what's going to happen yet. We don't even know when we can travel or if we can travel or even if these runs and stuff are going ahead. But New York is definitely somewhere where we want to go. Found a very very cool hotel. Mm -hmm. Well, you found a very cool hotel. Oh yeah, sorry. It's What's it called? It's the TWA Hotel at JFK. Yeah. Take T my breath. TWA Hotel at JFK. You have to go and check it out. It looks incredible. It's like a rooftop pool as well. That's like on the on the runway, the apron, so you can just overlook the terminal and stuff. And it looks amazing. Um, God, it's freezing. Baltic in here. Day after tomorrow. Come on, Minnie, warm it up. I know you like the chill, the cold. Well, come on. That's ridiculous. Difficult to on. Right, I've got to go warm up before my hand freezes up. 
Uh, we'll probably catch you in B&Q. Filter coffee with milk? I can do you in Miracle for the same price. We haven't got no filter on today. That's absolutely fine, yeah. Yeah, a large filter coffee, was it? Yeah. With milk? Yeah. Yeah, anything else? Yeah, uh, can I get a grande latte with three sugars? And a grande latte with three sugars? Yeah? Yep. Yeah. Wrap your teeth with all that sugar. What it for? Oh my god. Sorry. Oh my god, look at the size of those pod pots. It's incredible. Jesus. Go stand next to it. Jesus, a bit of Yeah. That's me hot tub, that. I'm get dunked into it. How incredible. What's the point in that? There's your dog. Finally got you a dog for your birthday. There you go. Uh, no. Is that what you want? No. I'm breed. That guy's cute down there though. Oh, look at that Buddha. I like that Buddha. What a grass Buddha. I like the sheep. Oh, he's so cute. What can we do with the sheep? Stick him in our seating area. So we have just come to a garden centre heading to Bent's which is a really popular garden centre. The car park is quite full right now. We're going to see what we can find in here. Um, they've also got a food hall which will be open and a great butchers and stuff so we're going to have a look around there as well. Look at the size of that queuing pen. That's bigger than queuing up for the Splash Mountain. Look at the size of it. That's incredible. Get a giant snow globe for the garden. That's the strangest thing ever. Why on earth would you have that in your garden? Very strange. Oh look, more rocks. I haven't got all day, you know. Thanks. Currently stood waiting for David in the rain. He's gone to move the car because I cannot shift this lot. And neither can he because he's really out of puff. So wait for him to come back with the car. And then we're going to go back in and have a quick look round because I haven't finished shopping. Because um, there's a couple of bits I want to pick up that I saw when I was going round. But we can't push these because we look like idiots and we can't push them in a straight line. Definitely not good for the back. Just come into the food section but how cute are these? So it's a white chocolate and raspberry tray bake mix. They are really cute presents. An Easter egg gingerbread baking kit. Ooh, giant cookie. That looks good. Skillet cookie. Yeah. Dinosaur. But it looks incredible. We don't need anything. But it all looks incredible. This food just looks amazing. I bet they are really lovely. Harry won't like them, but I bet they're really nice. Just come to the traffic centre to pick up the five guys. Oh my god, it's so weird being in here. Everything's shut. There's a couple of people milling around. Um, a couple of people just picking up food orders. And I think I assume click and collect from some of the shops. I know places like Boots, sorry, my mask has fallen down. I know places like Boots have opened and Marks and Spencer's food hall. But everywhere else is closed, so it's really, really bizarre. The toilets are shut though, which isn't great. <laughs> but then again. They have to clean them, don't they? So that's why. I'm gonna go off and enjoy this. Can't wait, I am starving. Out, out hot. It's good though, I've not opened my burger yet. Look at all those fries. A big caution here, I think we got far too many. Never have too many. David's got a cheese and bacon burger. With lettuce, I have got a cheese and bacon burger with lettuce, pickles, onions. 
I mean, how good is this burger? So it's a couple of hours later, we're back at home, pick the kids up, crazy granddad is here, we're just having a go of Mario Kart, and uh, winner stays on, um, Harry won the first round against David, then Emily won the second round, and now crazy granddad's playing. I am trying one of my mothership cocktails, why not? It's a birthday celebration, so I've got the cosmopolitan one, let me have a give it a go, not a very nice cocktail glass but still tastes the same. Not bad. It's got a kick to it. It's really nice, actually. <sighs> yeah, that's good. So we're just having a go. Sorry. Itchy ear. You don't want to see that. Excuse my friend here. The, caused by the mask. And then the mask rubs the makeup off as well. It's not great. Um, let's hope David airbrushes it out. And I'm talking about nothing. Um, I'm going to have a quick few rounds of Mario Kart. I'm going to have a couple of party games. I've got a pinata. Might show it, we might not, it just depends. Obviously Emily doesn't want to be on the camera, which is fine, I get that. Um, so I'd rather have fun with the family than film. So David's just trying to put one of the pinatas up, but I will show you one of the pinatas we bought. There was a little bit of a mistake when I bought it. So look. Here's a pinata. Yeah, it's a bit small. There's the real one. Who's going first? I think it's you, do you? Oh, right, okay. nope. got to be blindfolded. One, two, three, go. Go on, hit it. <laughs> Get on your knees. Knees. a considerable time later we obviously finished with the pinatas we played a bit of mario kart again we had some pizza again i feel like we're going to turn into a takeaway but it, who cares today nobody cares um yeah cleaned up the pinata stuff then we had a family zoom quiz if anyone wants to play it <laughs> i made a quiz about david um i knew a very short quiz about david and then i made another quiz um general knowledge disney marvel and Harry Potter and so yeah I made that quiz for all the family about 40 questions in total then we had some cake I am now in a Costco cake coma um hopefully David will leave a picture and show you what it looked like um 
Costco cake with all the little aliens that I got for it. I've just, well, I've, I say cleaned up. I've done the dishes, I've mopped the kitchen, I've put the tablecloth away, so I've sort of like sorted everything out. David has just dropped Crazy Grandad off at home and I did it again. I went on the app and I got a too good to go order. So I found it and they've never been on there before. So I was just really intrigued to what it was. So local to the airport, they've got a Marks and Spencer's at the BP garage. Yeah, Marks and Spencer's food. It was four pound. Um, and I was, just didn't have a clue what you could get. I mean, you could get anything from Marks and Spencer's pretty much at Marks and Spencer's food. So let me show you what we got. Now I'm quite impressed with this haul. It's too good to go. It's fabulous. Look at this. We have got a smoked ham and mustard and mayonnaise sandwich. So I will be eating that with my soup tomorrow. We've got some Subway sub rolls that we can either have tomorrow or go in the freezer. Look at these carrots. These perfect carrots. Emily will probably take them to school tomorrow with some hummus. Two pan of chocolates that um, the kids will have tomorrow for breakfast. And this sticky toffee pudding. So the sticky toffee pudding should be £4.50. We paid £4 for haul all together. How amazing is that? I am tired now. It's been a very, very long day. I've had a fabulous day and so has David. We had lots and lots of fun. But that's why we're gonna call it for today's vlog. Yep, I'm not sure if it's gonna be one part or two parts because I can imagine this footage over the weekend and today is going to be about 45 minutes long. So I apologize guys. Um, yeah. I like filming and I like talking to everybody and telling you what I'm up to. So if you've watched us all the way to the end and watched us the end of this birthday vlog, then thank you very much. I really, we really appreciate it. I definitely appreciate it. Don't forget to give us that big thumbs up. I'd love to get into double figures for once with those thumbs up. For some reason I don't, and I don't know why. So please give us those thumbs up. Leave the comments down below. Um, I love hearing from you. I love fi finding out what you've been up to, if you're doing anything similar to us. Have you got any amazing Too Good To Go orders? Got a day off tomorrow. Won't be filming, having a nice day off, going for a run, doing some bits. Um, so I will see you again on next week's vlog. Um, catch you later, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.